Church's Chicken, the Tex Supreme Sandwich. Mm. Oh boy. Wow. Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Kendomic food review just for you. I am in the bright, sunny, hot city of Brampton, Ontario, Canada at this Church's Chicken location. Very hard to say. Church's Chicken. Say that 10 times fast. I don't think I could. But it's right behind me. Uh, this is the closest one to where I was and I thought it's about time I check out this place. The one sandwich I would like to try first, the Tex Supreme Sandwich, but I'm gonna do the combo. Uh, I might also grab their um, their jalapeno poppers or something like that they have here. So let's go in there, grab that food, come back here and eat it with you. Are you ready? Let's go. back in the car ladies and gentlemen let's get out our trusty tray put that down i got coke it's nice and cold carbonated just the way i like it got napkins actually nice plushy type napkins i'm liking that i got a backup water i got the jalapeno poppers look how cute that bag is Ooh la la. and the car honks appropriately all right, let's check this out. Let's compare this one to the one I found on the internet. Are you ready? Ding! Is it close? Probably not. All right, it smells amazing, by the way. So let's just take it apart. You said a, a mild mayo, so I wasn't sure. That's just regular mayo. Uh, the chunk of chicken it's not as big as Mary Brown's chunk of chicken as you saw in one of my last videos, but it looks tender, moist, fresh. Looks like they, they slid it to make sure it was cooked in the middle. That's what I do when I'm barbecuing because I'm not a professional chef or anything. We've got a slice of processed cheese on there and then lots of lettuce shredded, which makes it really messy for a car situation and the tiniest tomato I've ever seen on a sandwich. Church's chicken, don't give people, if you're gonna give somebody a small little tomato, give them at least two small little tomatoes to make up for the fact that you wouldn't give them a large tomato. <laughs> Let me know if, if you're with me on that one. I think you would be. I, I, I would, if I was eating inside right now, I'd say, can you put another tomato on there? Cause the one you gave me was just really small. I don't want the small one. Ooh la la. All right, let's take a bite. Mm. Oh boy. Wow. Crunchy chicken batter. And then you got that moist, fresh chicken. Oh my gosh. The cheese is helping a bit. Just adding to it, you know what I mean? I still haven't got to the tomato. That's what I'm saying, churches. Don't ever do that to a customer again. Give them what's right for, rightfully theirs which is enough tomato that I get them. That was two bites and I still haven't got the tomato. Okay, I'm gonna put those in here. Little jalapeno poppers. Check that out. Scratch it, sniff it, the rest is mine. Woo! Whoa! And that gave me a little kick to the taste buds. It's still building. 
Um, just because of the shape of them, I was thinking that it was a jalapeno stuffed with cheese, but it looks like it might be a cheese jalapeno blend, and then they probably freeze them and then batter them, then deep fry them, because it doesn't seem, yeah, it looks like just chunks, possibly, little chunks of jalapeno, but they're definitely giving me a, a kick. Super powerful. Hmm, putting those on that, that might just change things up a bit. Third bite, no tomato. <laughs> I'm gonna find something to complain about. And then I always come back to the fact that the, ten the sandwich itself tastes amazing. And I'm loving every single bite, but I have that one issue. Oh no! Oh no! I'm so glad it hit the tray, but because they cut the chicken, it felt, but it almost went into the floor. Mmm. Tray food. Mmm. I hope I washed the tray lately, recently. <laughs> to put this up another notch, if they use an actual nice big square piece of fresh cheddar on top of that as opposed to a processed slice, I'd pay for that upgrade. Because it would definitely change the dynamics of that sandwich. Mmm. Oh, crunchy. Mm. People have been asking me to come to the uh, church's chicken. I'm not sure when it first came to Canada, but there seems to be like about five or six locations in Southern Ontario. I didn't notice. There are other provinces that have them. I'm not sure off the top of my head which ones or where they are located. But I think it's a pretty big chain in the States. Can't remember where I was last to where I first ever saw one of these. But I've seen other food reviewers do Church's Chicken and was disappointed we didn't have them up here. But now they're up here, I'll definitely be coming back. That's how good the sandwich is. A lot of American companies will come up to Canada, try out their bunch, bunch of locations, and uh, they'll either be successful or they'll fail. Um, Carl's Jr. is a perfect example. They had at least five locations in Southern Ontario, and they just put so much money into how it looks and I think they just couldn't recoup the money fast enough and uh, they all went belly up. Which was sad because uh, Carl's Jr. makes a pretty good burger. Somebody's got their bass turned up nice and loud. Mmm. If I didn't get in the tomato and having the tomato on there guys definitely greatly definitely greatly improves the flavor of the sandwich and the experience so next time you get your sandwich if you come here just take the lid off make sure they've uh, given you enough tomato for every single bite because it's definitely a must-have on the sandwich let me know if you've been ripped off by them giving you a small tomato. And I don't mind small tomatoes. Just give me more. Give me small, four small tomatoes. I'm good. Mm. These poppers are dynamite. Next time I come here, I'll definitely try a different side. But these are good. Mm. Can't go wrong with that sandwich, can you? I want that to be my last bite. Oh yeah. So I think this is my second time doing a review in Brampton, Ontario. And I'd love to know if any of you guys have been around long enough for you to know the last video I shot in Brampton. First one gets a virtual high five and a possible shout out in the next video. All right guys, I am loving this Church's Chicken Tech Supreme sandwich and combo so much we're gonna have to give it a one o'clock in the morning shout out bite. This bite goes out to all my subscribers, followers, and supporters of this channel. This bite's for you. Mmm. Oh boy.
I'm glad I saved that bite for last. Mmm. Mmm. One last sip. Crunch, sip, repeat. That's funny. No bones about it. This is good chicken. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Two points for Ken. Did it go in? Of course it did. All right, guys, on my rating scale, I'm gonna have to give Church's, <laughs> Church's Chicken the Tex Supreme Sandwich and Jalapeno Poppers and Pop Combo a go out and get it now. It was superb. Once again, the only issue I had was the fact when you give somebody a small tomato, at least give them two. I understand maybe you're only supposed to give them one, but give them a tomato. That's the same size as the chicken. That's what I was expecting, and I didn't get that. So I'm still gonna give you a go out and get it now. If you love these videos and you don't wanna miss the next one, please hit that subscribe button. It sits right around here. Click the notification bell. But if you wanna show your support for me doing these videos just for you, then hit it with a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time on another Ken Domic Food Review. Ken Domic out. Boop. Is everything off? There's like a rumble. I think it's the car behind me. Come on, come on. Come on, silly monitor. Let's do that again. I'll keep the bag in the proper hand. I didn't turn my lights on. Let's start again. We've got a slice of processed. All right, guys, I'm loving this so much that I'm gonna have to give this a burp. This bite goes out to all the fans. No, oh, see, I keep changing it. This bite goes out to all my subscribers. Scoop, scoop, scabbers. No bones about it. This chick. No bone. No bones about it. Coppers, you can't get me. Okay, it's an ambulance. They can't get me either. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.